All right. So we're here with. <laughs> In the meantime, we're here with the founder of Minds Up Initiative, and we're going to be launching the Minds Up Initiative tomorrow at our alma mater. We're, we have the pleasure of speaking with the founder, Mr. Kamir Ricketts. It's an honor. Let's go. I'm a title. I am feeling excited but a bit overwhelmed with all the things we have to do the night before. We we'll probably get t shirt. Show me t shirt them. So I'm and then glad. People decide so they want to change their size after my accident for a long time. But you know we're not showing a name. You know, so. Make sure it's on go check out the website. Yeah. It's up and live, should be by now. Yes. When this is posted. I came to speak here at UWE and and uh, Herbert Marcel last year in 2018, mm -hmm. back in November. And you know, speaking to the students about you know, you know, choosing a career and finding your passion and navigating that whole thing. You know, based on the questions I got from them, you realize a lot of them feel like there is it is lacking in terms of guidance available to them or resources available to them for them to kind of really figure out you know what are the pros and cons and what are the skills that they are involved in certain career fields and you know they generally don't get a chance to meet people in their field until you know way too late you know they already you know picked a major in university and so on maybe after university before they actually you know once they're in the profession they actually meet people in the profession so the figure said that don't make any sense so we're trying to put together something where we can get students you know engaging in professionals from early and um, being able to ask a really important questions and questions they didn't think they needed to ask, you know, in order to make an uh, informed and strategic decision about their career. So that is where this whole thing started. Stay tuned and see you soon. Alright, so we're off to the interview. Yep. Alright. Let's do this. You're here, mm -hmm. RDR Communications Group, mm -hmm. aka TVJ. Elad. Elad, Eli. Eli. It's an honor and a privilege to try and mentor young people and hopefully make a better journey. I'm a surgeon, medicine. Okay, cool. Mm -hmm. Well, it's nice to be a fellow mentor. You're welcome. I'm Jamila. Jamila. Thanks for introducing us, founder. I know, it's such a... <laughs> Eli, this is your fellow mind. Jamila, Jamila, this is your fellow mind. So we, we found out that one. Right right yeah. Alright, so Minds of Jamaica officially launches to get a And you know, you can now go on there and say, you know, ask a question. Don't mind if you subscribe to the service and you know. Welcome back to my channel. Follow, subscribe, share. You know what I mean? Get me to 500k subscribers. It's like on zero though. We have Sashin, she's one of our minds. A minds maker, she's an art, a digital marketer all around extraordinaire and then behind the camera is Jamila our musician mind they she will teach me already. teach me how to play the standing bass oh. our upright bass both of them right right <laughs> yeah so we just got a, a, a message after, after the interview from a, a dr tom Wright saying good morning i saw your interview on tvj this morning i live in montego bay and always wanted to be aligned with students as a mentor. I need to know how I can get involved as a mind. Please advise. Oh, we just get an email to somebody to sign up as a user. Yeah, get a big up phone. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so I am here at my alma mater. <laughs> Herbert Martin Technical High. I feel very good to come back in you know, this way. Greatness, I'm running on the blood. Greatness, I'm running on the blood. Greatness, I'm running on the blood. Greatness, I'm running on the 
Jamaica. And today is the build up of all the work that we've done so far. The mindset, yeah, and the whole vibe. Yeah, and I'm really excited for today. 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 Yeah,